Good morning, Patricia. Hey, good morning. Okay, now how long have you been crewing with Susanna? Oh, nearl oh, nearly a year, since last year. Okay, <laughs> and when you, were you on the programme before that? Uh, no, I wasn't. Uh, I met Susanna in London when she came on one of the to London property um, okay. show, and um, and I knew she was she was so good. And she said, when she said she was looking for volunteers, I thought, well, I'm on board. Okay. You know, because I thought if you she was so good, and I wanted to learn from the best. And if I was going to be crewing with her, I thought, wow, that's the best place to learn. So okay. that's why I joined her crew. So what did you hope to learn and achieve when you joined the crew? I want to be the best. I want to be better than her. I liked the idea of encouraging people to join her crew membership, uh, her members, and then um, become better than she is, which is extremely, Support extremely, uh, yes, fascinating for me and um, very supportive she has been. And so, you know, you, you can't get that from everyone. You can't get that from anywhere. When someone says, you know, be the best and be better than I am, you know, that is incredible so i thought yes i'm going to be the best better than she is and then i'm sure she, that gives her pleasure as well okay um, so have you uh, just done the uh, academic learning side of it or have you actually taken some executive action during your year on the, uh, the event crew um i've done both really um i'm taking the education side of things and the you know the executive side, the other things i'm trying building my own portfolio you know, through working with her. So, so you've and actually bought some properties in the meantime, have you? I'm on the road. I'm just going to buy one now. I'm, in fact, two actually are in the process of being bought since the last mentoring um, um, session we had. Excellent. Um, and I went away with the tips she gave me, uh, went into my area and met people who had never had developers in their area and they were prepared to give me properties. And one of them has actually given me two. And he says, if you bought this property now with your investors, you know, I'll be bringing properties your way. So that is extremely no, okay. um, rewarding. Can you tell me a couple of the things that you have done that you've learned on the program which you wouldn't have known about previously? Um, yeah, a couple of things. I could give you loads of them, but I'll just give you two if that's but what you're asking for. Okay. <laughs> is it tons of things to give? Okay. Uh, the first one is building your business, you know, building the team that you want first. You know, I, I would, for my business background, I would have probably waited until I had enough money to start building my, you know, my team. But from, her, from what she taught us, I thought I'll start building. She said, build your business, your team now. And that's what I've gone ahead to do. So I've rec I'm recruiting apprentices, you okay. know, and then I'm recruiting part-time staff who are going to be in the team. Because otherwise, it's a lonely journey working on your own as a business owner. And I found that very difficult in my previous businesses. So I thought I would take on what she said. And the second thing I've learned from her is that you don't need the money just yet before you start buying properties. So get the properties and put the JVs together. You know, that was a bit of a marathon race for me because I was a bit um, skeptical about on how to do that. I'm thinking, shouldn't I get the money first? But I don't think you need that. Go out, get the properties, and then once you've got them, the money, is, the money will come because then you have ideas of how to, who to go to and how to contact the JV partners for money. That's great. So you've been working with Susanna for a year now. Yes. You're going to carry on? Uh, yes, I will. I'll carry on as long as it takes to learn, <laughs> to learn as much as you can give. Uh, and because I really want to give to other people too. So the key thing for me is, you know, since she's willing to give, I am so willing to give. So it's like, you know, too much. So we are on the road to give, you know, as much as we can take. Okay, so. that's champion. We will uh, interview you again in a couple of three months' time and see how you're getting on with it all. Thank yeah, you I look forward to that. Thank you so much. <laughs>